Hi, thank you for joining me today. We've been reading through A Course in Miracles, The Daily Lessons, and uh, we are on the last lesson in the section called uh, What is the World? And so we are on lesson 250, and that's the last one in this segment. Lesson 250, let me not see myself as limited. Let me not see myself as limited. Let me behold the Son of God today and witness to his glory. Let me not try to obscure the holy light in him and see his strength diminished and reduced to frailty, nor perceive the lacks in him with which I would attack his sovereignty. He is your Son, my Father, and today I would behold his gentleness instead of my illusions. He is what I am, and as I see him, so I see myself. Today I would see very truly that this day I may at last identify with him. Wow, what a powerful and beautiful lesson. Let me read it again. Let me not see myself as limited. Let me not see myself as limited. Let me behold the Son of God today and witness to his glory. Let me not try to obscure the holy light in him and see his strength diminished and reduced to frailty, nor perceive the lacks in him which I would attack his sovereignty. He is your son, my father and today I would behold his gentleness instead of my illusions. He is what I am, and as I see myself, as I see him, so I see myself. Today I would see truly that this day I may at last identify with him. So this is challenging because your ego is going to want to run with this um, as it tends to always want to do, to be in charge. Um, but you're going to need to, to keep your ego in check as you work with this lesson, because this lesson is basically the lesson that you are divinity in form. You are not limited. And it is only through your allowance of these ideas and your acceptance of them that you can actually experience yourself as unlimited. Many people do uh, experience things that, that indicate their unlimitedness, and they quite often just attribute them to coincidences. When, you, when your heart really yearns for something to happen, a person or a thing or something, and then it actually shows up in your life, quite often, we don't take credit for that, and we, we chalk it up to a coincidence. But you are not limited, and when you step into your shoes of divinity in form, you will experience your lack of limitation on a daily basis. And it's just important to remember and to stay humble. You're no special, you're no more special, than anyone else, and you don't have any extra powers of anybody else. We all have the powers of divinity. Whether we're using them or not is a different question. But let you not see yourself as limited anymore. And I hope you have a beautiful experience with this lesson today. And if you'd like additional support, you can reach out to me, 907-351-3003. You can uh, message me on YouTube or on Facebook or on my website, lindalamp.com or lindalamp.shop. Thank you so much, and we'll see you for the next uh, module. So we've got the next uh, focus lesson we'll start with uh, tomorrow and then the, the appropriate daily lesson to go with it. Again, thank you for joining me. Namaste and much love.